Welcome to GFGN. This is a great food segment. We're in downtown Phoenix at the corner of First Avenue in Washington at Tom's Tavern, established in 1929. Let's go see what it's all about. a great food this is a place to try out we're here with Ernie Vega general manager we appreciate you talking with us today thanks for coming okay this place local icon here in the valley there's a lot of history behind it there there is believe it or not Tom's Tavern has been around since 1929 wow. back in the day it used to be on Adams Street it was actually a pool hall and the way the story goes was that back then uh, more court cases probably got solved in the pool hall than they did back in the office so what keeps customers coming back you know, I think it's really about the rich history and all. This uh, Tom's been around so long, and there's been a number of uh, famous people that have come in over the years, and there's still to this day, every day you can see a new face in here. So I got to twist your arm. Who are those famous faces? Oh, uh, I think I might let them have their anonymity, but I, to name some of the bigger ones, I'd probably say uh, George Bush Jr., uh, Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, but it, the list really goes on. There's hundreds of them. So when I'm here, I can feel the ambiance, and it feels like a really friendly restaurant. So is the name fitting? You know, I think the name, especially the, the tavern part, is really more about the history. But it's evolved over the years, and nowadays it's really more about a, a wonderful, beautiful restaurant where you can take your family and your kids, come to a nice spot before you go to a game, before you go to a concert or a venue, maybe reserve our, our private uh, our governor's room, which is listed all of our governors on the wall. I love it. Ernie, thank you so much for talking with us. And yeah, Trey's not in the governor's area, but he is in the kitchen cooking up something. So go figure. Guys, we're here with executive chef Jason Choate. Good to meet you. Trey, good to see you. And I understand you're going to make something awesome for us. Isn't we you? are. We're going to make brisket chili this morning. Let's do it. All right. What you got? 1929 recipe. We've got the holy trinity of peppers, onions, and uh, and garlic Dump in Dump it in, baby. All That's right. That's going to go right in. It All also right. has our spice blend right in there. Okay. Great, great. Smells good already. Give that a little stir. You making this every day here? Every single day fresh. Okay. Um, so we're going to add a little bit of tomato paste in here. Okay. That's going to go in, mix in with our vegetables. Smelling good. Okay, what else are we going to roll in here? Okay, a little bit of vinegar and Worcestershire. Okay, yes. A little water. I'm seeing, is this beer? That is beer. Can that I, is can beer. I Would just, you mind to grab that for me oh, and just okay. dump that right in? I was going to ask you if I could drink it, but it gets Oh, got, no, we need that for the chili, uh, please. Uh, okay, I guess I can drink it when I taste it, right? That's right. <laughs> okay, thanks so much. All right, we got it. Okay, so we've got our beer. That yeah. was the good stuff. Uh, why don't you go ahead and dump those beans in for me? Looks like two kinds. We do. We've got kidney and black beans right there. Awesome. This is all part of the 29 recipe? That right? is all part of the 1929 recipe. Now, what about this? Okay. In 1929, they used ground beef. Today, we're using our in-house smoked brisket. Good call. Beautiful stuff. I love brisket. Man, you put a lot in there. Oh, yeah. Every bite should have a big chunk of brisket in it for you. Did you say bite? That's what I'm going to need. That's <laughs> right. We're going to get you some of this right quick. All right, I can't wait to uh, have So a we'll let this simmer it. all day. Okay. Um, and like I said, made fresh every day for every guest. Okay, how about my bite? Okay, your bite's coming right now. Let's awesome. get you that. Okay. Well, Chef, this looks amazing. I, I've got to try this. Thank uh, you so much, Trey. Uh, wow, i got to get a lot of brisket in there. Oh, wow. Come on, if you've got a brisket here, you've got to have a smoker. Right? I do. I've got a giant smoker back here. Can we go check that Let's out? Let's go take a look at that. All right. I'll, you go and I'll eat. Okay. Jason, this has got to be it. This is. This is the magic box right here. All the brisket and pork butt you could uh, ever want for a day. This is a meat vault. It is. This is my money room right here. Uh, Fresh brisket, pork butt, oh, chopped man. to order for every guest. You know, Jason, I appreciate it, but I've got to go catch up with Lisa. I understand she's ordered some of the signature dishes that you guys have created. So I've got to go join her. Look what is coming. I know, it looks food. so good. Hey, that's our new dish, Trey. The new Southwest Bacon Burger. 
Oh, that looks awesome. Looks and delicious. jalapeno bacon wrap poppers with cream cheese. And I got the quinoa salad. All right, I gotta start eating. Trey, what? put your napkin in your lap. Oh, okay, all right. That's a wrap on GFGN. See you next time, guys. Ooh. <laughs> Thank you.